Assalamu alaikum everyone, I hope you are all having a wonderful day. In today's video, I am going to show you how to delete duplicate files on Windows 10 or Windows 11 computers using three simple methods. With these three methods, you can find and delete duplicate files from your Windows computers and that is coming up. The first method is Windows File Explorer. Here's how it works. First of all, click on this Windows logo, then search for indexing options. Here it is, just select it, then it will bring up this window. Now click on modify. Make sure you select all these locations. Then click on show all locations. Again, tick mark all these places. Then click on OK and close it. Now head over to your file explorer, open up your C drive, then open your users folder, then click on search and now Type the extension of the file that you want to delete. So in my case, I have some duplicate JPG files on my C drive. So I have to search for it. In your case, if it is video, then type .mp4, avi, mkv, etc. I hope you got what I mean. Okay. After searching for the file, click on view, select details, and then click on sort, and make sure you select the name. Then you will have all these duplicate files. As you can see here I have several duplicate files so all you have to do is select them and delete them. I know this method is kind of hectic because you have to find and delete all the duplicate files manually. If you want an easier solution then watch the second method or the third method. Our second method is using a software to delete duplicate files from your computer. In this video I am going to use the software called for the duplicate file deleter which is an AI powered software. You can get it from the link given in the video description below. So just click on free download and install it into your windows computer. After the installation open it up. Once open this software gives you two options to find and delete duplicate files. The first option is duplicates. If you select the first option what the software will do is it will scan your computer for all kind of duplicate files. and if you want to find and delete only photos, then you can select the second option. And if you click on toolkit, there will have other options. If you are interested, you can check it out. Okay, I'm gonna go with the first option. So select it and click on get started. Next, you have to select the location to scan for duplicate files. This software can also find and delete duplicate files from your cloud drives if you have any. So I'm gonna select the local drive option, then click on next. Now select the drive that you want to scan. You can also select an individual folder by clicking on this option. So I'm gonna select all my drives then click on scan. And now all you have to do is wait for the software to find and delete duplicate files from your computer. This process will take time depending on how much duplicate files you have. While the software is scanning my computer let me show you my computer drives which are almost full as you can see they both turn red. You just let the software do its job. As you can see this software has scanned around 81,000 files and all of those files are taking around 150 GB. Most of which are videos and photos as you can see in the red and orange column. Ok now you have two options. You can either remove those duplicate files by clicking on this smart remove button or you can preview them. If you click on smart remove then you will not be able to preview what you are deleting. So I'm just gonna review my duplicate files. Okay, now all you have to do is select your duplicate files. So as you can see, on the first group, I have three duplicate files. And if I click on select all, this software will only select duplicates, not the original one. If you want to select them all, click on this auto select option. Then you can either select the oldest or latest. So I'm gonna select latest, which will select all the files from latest to oldest. Okay, after selecting your files, if you click on this arrow, there you will have three options. You can either remove those selected files to trash, I mean recycle bin, or you can remove them permanently, or you can remove to a different folder. So in my case, I'm gonna delete them permanently. So I'm gonna select the second option, then click on this blue button to confirm your choice. Click yes. And now wait for the software to remove your duplicate files. And after removing these, I should have a lot of space freed up on my computer. 
Okay, once your files are deleted, click on complete and close the software. And now when I open my file explorer, as you can see, the software has freed up a lot of space from my C and D drive. All right, now let me show you the third and last method. Our third and last method is using CMD to delete duplicate files from your Windows computer. This method works with those kind of files that have the word copy after the file name. Let me show you what I mean. So as you can see, here I have some photos. If I copy paste these photos, as you can see, the duplicate file has the word copy on it. This method works with this kind of duplicate files. So in order to make it work, first of all, click on this address bar and copy the location of this folder. Then click on Windows icon, type CMD, which will bring up this command prompt option. Just click on it. Once the CMD is open, type the following command, type CD space and, and paste the location of your folder. Then hit enter. Then type DEL space inverted comma star type the word copy again star and comma and then hit enter and now when i open this folder as you can see the files with the word copy are gone see now there is no file that has the word copy on it that is how simple it is so there you have it guys, that is my video on how to delete duplicate files on Windows computers. Please let me know what do you think about this video in the comment section below, I would love to hear them. And also, if you learned something new from this video, then please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. You are one like and share means a world to me, so thank you so so much if you do. And if you want more videos like this in the future, then please subscribe to my channel and I will catch you on the next one. Stay blessed, stay safe. Bye.